what is going on everyone broken mike here welcome back to the channel and welcome back to this week's episode of buw this is episode 108 part 2 so if you guys missed any of the action in part one then do be sure to go on over and check that one out as you can see we're going to be kicking off part two with a tag team match from the women's division and it'll be alley cat and bubbly zen the zen cats and they'll be taking on sapphire and heli hellfire who's going to get the win here let's find out So, of course, if you guys do enjoy this one, then do make sure to hit the like for Mike. Slap any comments down below and do be sure to hit the subscribe button and click on your notification bell to stay up to date with all things gaming and, of course, all things BUW. for a fight. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring. The tag Making their way down to the ring first. Alley Cat and Bubbly Zen. The Zen Cats. Ali Cat, of course, is the uh, number one contender to the Women's YouTube Championship, which is currently being held by Heli. And, of course, Bubbly Zen will be in the Women's Journey to Gold ladder match, where she'll be looking to obtain the briefcase for a future Women's World title match. Of course, they're looking to score big again here tonight. Against a red hot, no pun intended, Hellfire. Look who's here. Oh, ho, ho. fire. And making their way down to the ring next. The current BUW Intercontinental Women's Champion Sapphire. And the current Women's YouTube Champion Heli. Hellfire. Of course these two have been on an absolute roll as of late. Sapphire of course will... Uh, have her hands full at Journey to Gold. She'll be facing Chloe in a rematch for the Women's Intercontinental Championship. And as of course, as we mentioned, Haley will be defending the Women's YouTube Championship against Ali Cat. 
Of course, one of the number one contenders match at Broken Asylum. So it looks like it's going to be Bubbly Zen and Sapphire starting things off. And here we go. And Bubbly coming out the gates quick. With some kicks and a quick tag to Alley Cat. Sapphire looking for the right hand, but Alley Cat well defended there. Inverted suplex from Sapphire. Targeting the right arm of Alley Cat. Follows up with a standing moonsault. And Alley Cat with a counter there to Dragon Screw. And there's a tag back into Bubbly Zen. That Sapphire with some strikes and inverted atomic drop. Kicked in the midsection. And a face buster, a version of Bubbly Zen's bubble buster. She won't like that too much. And there comes the current YouTube Women's Champion, Heli. And Bubbly Zen sends Heli over the top rope. Of course, no count outs are in effect. So these two ladies could stay out as long as they need to. But as long as the decision takes place in the middle of the ring. And look at Bubbly go here. Face first goes uh, Heli, and I'll tell you what, Bubbly Zen has shown a vicious streak in recent months. And of course, last week she qualified for the women's journey to gold by defeating Hannah. And then comes Alley Cat off the tag. And will we get a sneak peek of what's to come? at Journey to Gold between these two ladies where the women's YouTube title will be on the line. The hair pull next slam from Alley Cat. And Alley Cat getting the crowd all rolled up here. Fully behind Alley Cat, but look at the old lovely counter there. Waist lock into the German suplex. Right hand, down goes Alley Cat. And Heli tags in Sapphire. The current Women's Intercontinental Champion. Delivering some blows. And drops Alley with a DDT into the cover now. Just a one count. Elbow drop to the back. And looks like the Anaconda Vice from Sapphire. Will Alley Cat submit here? And Alley Cat with the knees to the back of the head, able to fight out the submission. And a bat breaker from Alley Cat and, and a net breaker as well to boot. And now the Zen Cat's back in control. The takedown. Bubbly Zen, no one home. Kicked in the midsection from Zapfire and look out! Twist of fate from Sapphire. But Bubbly Zen's arm was on the rope, so a rope break it is. And Sapphire. No way! Swanton Bomb Freak calls across the ring. Are you kidding me? Oh! And I thought that was. Don't know what happened there, guys. Anyway, Sapphire coming in with an eyelash of winning this matchup and bubbly zen on the comeback of those kicks oh look at that it managed to get her foot right the back of her head and connected with sapphire's head great stuff and alley cat tagged in and calling sapphire to her feet there's a clothesline The right hand from Alley Cat kicked in the midsection of her DDT. And Sapphire fights free. Kick to the midsection from Alley Cat. Sends Sapphire into the corner. Has the arm. And off the ropes. Springboard arm drag. Will this be enough for the Zen Cats? Oh! Very nearly for the Zen Cats. 
Alley Cat. Couldn't believe it. That was close, though. Both teams coming close within the last couple of minutes of winning this matchup. Kicks it. Oh, sorry, right hand and sat fire back on the offense. Kicks in the midsection. Another face buster. Another variation of Bubbly Zen's bubble buster. And that time that was right in front of her. Helly and off the tag. Kicks in the midsection. Double underhook butterfly suplex. Baseman drop kick to the back. Helly into the cover. Helly who's come out as uh, being in her element in uh, recent months. Absolutely probably one of the most improved superstars this current year. I will say that. A distraction from Bubbly Zen. Could it going to cause a distraction? But it, the distraction does not work. A exploder suplex. The hammerlock. And has the and she has the other arm. Oh! Bent the arm right back. Helly gets countered. Alley Cat back on the offense. Forearm to the face. There's a tag to Bubbly Zen. Kick to the knee. Whip into the corner. And that's what we call the tree of woe position, folks. And Helly being placed into the tree of woe. And a kick to the midsection. Oh, lovely counter from Helly. Kick to the gut. Double underhook. Suplex. And there's a tag in comes Sapphire now. The current women's intercontinental champion. Sit down, jawbreaker. And down goes Bubbly. And I'm sure that uh, Sapphire's opponent, Chloe, will be watching somewhere as this match progresses. A second DDT from Sapphire. And she's on a roll. And the fans loving what they're seeing so far. But Sapphire is showing off a bit too much. And there's a hot tag to Alley Cat. But wait a second. Suplex. Standing Moonstalt. Tag into Heli. Hellfire back in command. Whip into the corner. Alley Cat with a block. Jawbreaker counter. And there's a kick to the midsection. Alley Cat with the bankrupt net breaker into the cover. Near fall. Just a two count for Alley Cat. Zen Cat's nearly walked away with the win there. There's a right hand double knees, and you know what comes next the bank statement, but. But. Uh, Helly's feet. Or one of her feet was on the bottom rope. So Helly has a lucky escape. And Bubbly's in. Make the tag. Looking to pick up the pieces. And there's a rope break. Even though Sapphire did come in to make a, to make a break. And there goes Alley Cat. Sent over the top rope by Sapphire. Bulldog from Bubbly's in. Sapphire is down. And Bubbly's taking her attention away from Heli, the current YouTube champion. Hung out to dry on the top rope. Our stomp on the arm into the cover. Just a one count for Heli, and she can't believe it. There's a tag. Fire. Flying forearm. Kick to the spine. Into the cover. And a two count only. But even though Alley Cat did make a distraction. And there's a mi miscommunication between Hellfire. What's going on here? There goes Alley Cat. Fisherman suplex from Bubbly Zen. But, well, she did not want to go for the cover. Or she does now. One count only, and it's breaking down here at ringside. 
The two that will meet for the Women's YouTube Championship in just over a week's time. And look at Bubbly Zen. She's got Sapphire up. There, the, there it is, the detonation kick. Bubbly Zen has Sapphire right where she wants her. It's still going on at ringside cover. Oh, and Helly saves her partner. And there she goes again. Stomp on the arm. Top rope. Looking for an elbow drop. No one home. Sit down, jawbreaker. Sat fire. With a very suplex. Look on the outside, though. Sapphire's got the cover, but wait a second. German suplex on the outside from Heli. Goodness me, what are we seeing here? Sapphire heading to the well once again. Swanson bomb. And that could do it. And it's over. And Hellfire. Score a big win here tonight. These women put on quite a show. Here's another look. What a matchup. Albeit we did have a couple of technical glitches during that match. Which I do apologize for in advance. Fantastic match right here, guys. This is what BW is all about. Anyway, folks, here are your winners of the match. The Women's Intercontinental Champion, Sapphire, and the BUW Women's YouTube Champion, Heli, Hellfire. Wait a second. Oh, 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 fire. What a win for Hellfire. And we move on to our next matchup, is a, which will be another tag team match, but this time from the men's division. In this one, we will see the return of the world tag team champions. So it will be Davy Roche. And Nasho Co, the Nexus Nation. And they'll be taking on Will and Josh, the current World Tag Team Champions, 2 Bit Gaming. Of course, so we haven't seen 2 Bit Gaming since their hellacious Broken Asylum match at Broken Asylum just a few weeks ago. They took a some mighty nasty falls and it's taken a few weeks to recuperate any normal person would have taken longer to recover but this this folks is the world tag team champions and of course two bit gaming are all too familiar with the nexus nation They faced off at Wrestleverse just a few months ago. And of course, 2-Bit Gaming walked away still the World Tag Team Champions. And they're slowly starting to become in... Well, I think they might be closing in on the record for the longest reign with the Tag Team titles. Well, I'll have to look that one up. And they can't be too far away from that record, I will say.
The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 388 pounds. The tag team division here making their way down to the ring first. Davy Roche, Nash O'Kerr, the Nexus Nation. And what a bright young team these two are. Davy Roche had the match of a lifetime come in with an eyelash of winning the BUW Hardcore Championship. Meanwhile, last week, Nash O'Kerr gave Victor Wolf, well, he gave him a good showing on his debut. Nearly walking away with the win. Nearly upset. Nearly upsetting, I was trying to say. The true Wolverine. And of course, Victor Wolf Here got the victory on that one. But here they come. And their opponents, at a combined weight of 420 pounds, the World Tag Team Champions. The WWE and about to enter the ring next. Will and Josh, the BUW World Tag Team Champions. Two bit gaming. And we, like I said, guys, we have not seen these two in weeks after like, after that hellacious Broken Asylum match at said event against the OG boys. And they had a, like I said, they had a couple of nasty tumbles, but they're back here tonight. And things starting off with Will and Nash Okur. And like we said, these two teams know each other very well. They faced off at Wrestleverse with. Uh, 2-bit gaming leaving still the tag champions now oh, Nash O'Kerr with the elbow drop to the back the Nexus Nation trying to pick apart 2-bit gaming you got to wonder what physical condition are the tag champs in inverted, su inverted suplex on the uh, inverted gourd buster and Nash O'Kerr on a roll right here of course, should the uh, Nexus Nation get a win here, they could see themselves receive a future opportunity. Another opportunity, if you will, at the World Tag Team Championships. Uh, Davy Roche tagged in. There's a double team. And nicely done. Stump on the elbow. And then a kick to the back. And will oh gets drop kicked off the ring apron. Top rope, here we go. He has a right road. Referee calling for Davy Roche to come back down. Off the Oh wow! What a blockbuster from Davy Roche. Took a took a page out of the crazy playbook, so to speak. He got all of that blockbuster to the outside. The World Tag Team Champions at the moment just do not have a response for for this onslaught by the Nexus Nation. And in comes Josh. Two-bit gaming on the receiving it at the moment, but Josh looking to turn things round in the Tag Champs' favour. Josh, of course, a former two-time United Kingdom champion as well. Great singles wrestler as well. Oh, look out. Josh is in trouble here. Power bomb from Roche. A kick to the spine. The locker. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this strength. And a power slam from Davy Roche. And there's a tag to Nash O'Kur. Nexus Nation back in control. Basement drop kick to the spine. Kick to the knee. Off the ropes. Last shot from Nash O'Kur. That could be it. Oh, and that was close. Nash O'Kur nearly scored a win for the Nexus Nation, but no one home for the senton. 
And what a German release suplex from Josh. Will in off the tag. Sent into the corner. Head first off the top turnbuckle. A counter from Will. And there's a side effect from Will. We don't really see him do that too much. Left hands and rights. The hammerlock into a scoop slam. Now two bit gaming are on the rampage. Now the running knee. Will this do? And Davy Roche makes the save. Net breaker from Will sends Davy to the outside. And now Will looking to finish things off. With the figure four leg lock. Will Nash O'Kerr submit here? This is so excruciating, but wait a second, Nash is reversing the pressure. And Will can't take the pain. Both men have done some damage to one another. Into the corner goes Will. Into the turning around for a shot to the back. What a hammerlock around the ropes. That was unique from Nash. Now Nash stomping a mud hole in Will and walking it dry. Into the cover. Oh, and that was close. Nash O'Kura, the Nexus Nation, very nearly got one over on the tag champs. There's a tag to Davey. And a little double team here, double elbow. And Davey on the rampage, some right hands. And that bare knuckle mentality. Oh, was it? Was it? No, the referee says two. I thought that was three. Tag champions nearly coming cropper here. And there's a tag to Josh. No one home for, uh, for Josh. Double underhook from Davey into the suplex. Discus elbow drop. Attack to Nash. The lock up. Kick to the midsection. Nash finds himself in trouble with a sit down power bomb. Will this be enough for the tag team champions? Trying to shoot the half into the cover. And a two count only. Holy moly's. Nash says, uh uh uh. That's just a ta simple takedown, will this do? No, it won't. Just a two count for the Nexus Nation. Nash wrenching on the head and neck area of Josh. The tag champions are finding themselves in a bit of trouble here. The Nexus Nation trying to put on a performance of a lifetime net breaker. And the crowd are loving it. Kicked in the midsection. Waist lock. German suplex, but he's not done yet. And another suplex. It's sort of like... Uh, Davy Roche was sort of uh, taking Josh, pardon the pun, to the suplex kingdom. And there's the burning hammer. This is going to do it. Oh, was it again? No. Oh, I s oh goodness me. Tag team wrestling's a chance. Brain buster from Roche. We could finally see the Nexus Nation score a tag team victory over 2-Bit Gaming. We know they have an individual success over them, but will they have tag team success they could do here? Cover! They do! And the Nexus Nation have just pinned the World Tag Team Champions. The, fl the uh, flatliner from 
Davy Roche scores big on Josh and scores a big time victory for the Nexus Nation and that could put them in the front running for the World Tag Team titles. Well, I guess we'll have to wait and see what happens. But I would say they've earned a shot. Burning hammer there from Roche. Oh my goodness. What a tag team match. What a couple of tag team bangers we've just seen from both men's and women's division. Anyway, here are your winners of the match. Nash O'Curran, Davy Roche, the Nexus Nation. And what a victory for those two young men. Anyway, folks, that is going to do it for this part of BUW. If you have enjoyed it, then do be sure to hit the like for Mike. Slap any comments down below and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click on that notification bell to stay up to date with all things gaming and, of course, all things BUW. But don't you dare go anywhere, guys, because we still got five more matches still to come. We've got a number one contenders match for a future hardcore championship opportunity. Plus, we have got two humongous last chance journey to gold qualifying matches. So, that and a whole lot more still to come. So, until then, guys, do take care and I'll see you guys in part three. I will catch you all after this break.